Hey YouTube, it's your girl Adrena. Today I'm going to be doing a show and tell on this week, so if you want to see it, stick around and check it out. doing a show and tell on this wig this is my second time recording this video I did it a few days ago and it didn't come out the way I wanted it the video was too dark so here I am recording it again here I am doing it again hopefully it's clear hopefully my lighting is good hopefully you guys can see but this wig is amazing um, it is a wig from a company called Tinashe. First, I want to give you guys a, uh, a look of how the wig came before I put it on my head, before I cut off the lace. So here's a look at that. So this wig is from a company called Tanache. Um, I follow them on Instagram. Make sure you guys check them out. I'll put their Instagram link down below. So let me go ahead and get into the specs of this unit. This is a 14 inch bob human hair lace front wig. The color is 613. It has three combs as well as the adjustable strap and it is already pre-plucked so you don't have to do anything to assist just cut the lace and throw it on I wanted to have platinum hair since it is the winter so I did go ahead and tone the hair um, I did that in like one easy step I'll put the um I'll put the mini tutorial in on how I did that so here's the wig I'm gonna be toning it with the shimmer lights shampoo it's for blonde and silver hair but first i'm going to shampoo the hair with regular shampoo just to make sure there's no coating on there so the shimmer lights can take uh so it can take at its best so i'm just going to use some cheap suave coconut shampoo shampoo that to get whatever coating may have came on the 613 wig and then after that i will be applying the shimmer lights shampoo So now I'm done shampooing the wig with regular shampoo just to make sure there's no coating on the hair because I don't know what they process the hair with. So now I have my clear bucket. You can use any color bucket. I only have clear so you guys can see what's going on. I'm going to put some of the Shimmer Lights shampoo in there. Um, there's no specific measurements. I'm just going to eyeball it. The water is warm. It's not hot. It's not cold. Just going to put some in there and mix that up. I don't want to leave the hair in there too long because I don't want it to become purple or overtoned. I'm just going to dip it in a few times to take out the brassiness. So now that that's all mixed up, I'm just going to dunk in, we'll submerge my 613 wig. Hopefully you guys can see. So I can already tell that it's starting to process. I'm just going to dunk it a few times. I do want some icy white hair don't want it to be purple submerge it never leaving it in there and it looks pretty good so far you guys probably can't see because of my lighting I'm just gonna dip it for a few more seconds just to make certain Now I don't want it to be gray. I think it might be where I want it. So I'm going to go ahead and just rinse that out. No need to shampoo it out. All you have to do is rinse it out. Make sure it's rinsed out thoroughly because it's still processing. If you don't rinse it out. Now I don't want gray hair or purple hair. So going ahead and going to go ahead and get my water started. Well, now you can do this with the Wella toner, and I do have some, but the color I had, I didn't want to use because I want to go for that winter white hair. And so I think that's good enough. Just going to rinse it out. Now, make sure you rinse this out thoroughly because if, if it's not rinsed out, it will still continue to process. I will show you a before and after of the wig. 
So the hair came packaged in this nice silk little drawstring bag which comes in handy because I love to wash my wigs when I'm not wearing them and keep them stored in the silk bags and the silk bags let the hair hold its moisture so I love the bag that it came in and it says Tanache on the front human hair high quality best choice it also came with a little compact mirror um, I don't know if you guys can see it because the glare is showing like my camera and my Christmas tree and all that, but it says Tanache on the mirror, which is actually a heavy mirror. It's pretty good quality. Here's the mirror. It came with wig caps as well. It came with black. I'm not going to use black with platinum hair because it would show up too much, so I just put um, the standard wig cap under. I do have it glued down with the got to be glued blasting free spray I didn't use the gel this time I've been finding it easier here lately just to use the spray and then when it pops up on the side I'll spray it so I did shave my sideburns down as much as I could and I kind of just gelled this piece here it was covering my hair a little more but I've been wearing the wig for a few days now so it's kind of you know my hair starting to pop out a little I did not pluck, I did not bleach any knots, all I did was tone the wig, um, I did use the ball cap method and glued it down with my spray, see, give you guys a close up look at that color, and you can run your finger straight through this unit. So when you get this wig, you don't have to tone it. You can wear it exactly how it comes. But like I said, it's not summertime, so I wanted it to look like an icy white, like a platinum, uh, a platinum color. And one of my YouTube sisters, she always has platinum hair. You guys might know her. Um, I think it's Lala Honey 06, um, Platinum Doll La. That's that's my little internet sis. She always has the platinum hair, and now I know why because you just feel so luxurious with it. So shout out to my YouTube sis Lala Honey 06 um, I'll put her link down below so you can check her out mm-hmm yep but yeah this is very thick to be a blonde wig one of the last blonde wigs I had months ago it was kind of thin and you could see the tracks through the back so I really don't wear it like that but this is really full to be a blonde wig um, the texture is I just love the texture I can't even really explain how it feels but it's like really full let me see do I know the density I don't even know the density of this wig but it's very full it's very nice it's not shedding it's not tangling like well sheds but it's minimal shedding and you would think with bleached hair that it would shed a lot but it's actually pretty good like I said it is 14 inches it is in a bob comes to here on me I did part it on the left side you guys know how I am about my left side part I'll put the link down below I said the company's name is Tanache check them out I'll put the link to their website as well as their Instagram down below if you're not a subby to my YouTube channel what are you waiting for sis is free go ahead and subscribe hit on that bell button so every time I upload a video you guys get it first so you guys can get in on all the good wigs the good deals um, all that good stuff I hope you guys enjoy my show and tell stay tuned for the photos and until next time